the intended sale of Orange Uganda Limited to AfriCell Holdings of Beirut, Lebanon, is fraudulent at best as communicated to the Uganda Communications Commission on the 24th of August 2014, plus the Chief Executive Officer of Orange Uganda Limited. The plaintiffs who are employees of Orange Uganda Limited have engaged the legal services of Owen Murangi and co-advocates to recover their benefits as stated in their appointment letters from Orange Uganda Limited before the sale is effected. The parties involved are Orange Uganda Limited, Atlas Services Belgium, a wholly owned subsidiary of France Telecom, and AfriCell Holding of Beirut, Lebanon. If AfriCell Holding goes through with the purchase knowing the pending litigation has not been finalized, it will be an accessory to the fact of Orange Uganda Limited's intended fraud of absconding without paying its Ugandan employees' benefits, as stated in the appointment letters. Here lies the proof of these claims. This is a copy of the letter that was sent to the Executive Director of Uganda Communications Commission by the legal team on the 28th of August 2014. As indicated here, you can see that the letter was received on the said date. This is a copy of the letter that was sent to the Chief Executive Office of Orange Uganda Limited on the 4th of September 2014. Uh, to to read it properly, perhaps you have to pause the video as you go. This is the follow-up letter to the Chief Executive Office of Orange Uganda Limited, dated the 5th of September 2014. As you can see, there is a reduction of the notice period as compared to the previous letter of the 4th of September 2014.